today on Riff Spirits and Gear, we check out my brand new 2021 Mark Tremonti signature guitar from PRS. For those of you who follow me on Instagram, you would know that I recently got this unbelievable 2021 Mark Tremonti signature Paul Reed Smith guitar. Now, I acquired this from my good buddy James Schultz at Guitar Store and Quimper Sound in Port Townsend, Washington. Uh, he moved from Seattle. He moved locations. Um, I traded in my white 594 McCarty single cut guitar for a couple of different reasons. I recently put a Tremonti treble pickup in the bridge of that guitar. I really wanted it to be a Tremonti, but even though I put a Tremonti PRS pickup in it, it still wasn't a Tremonti. It was fixed bridge. It was like a tunematic style bridge. The neck was massive and it was also, it was a bright guitar and I liked the guitar, but I found that with the shorter scale, I had to have really, really heavy strings on it to get it to kind of sing and respond like I wanted it to. So I called up James and I said, hey, uh, I don't know what exactly I'm looking for. I wasn't specifically looking for another Paul Reed Smith, but I have some things I wanna maybe horse trade. How about I come up and we have some lunch, we hang out and we do some trading. And he said, yeah, absolutely. I get there and he looks at the, the McCarty and there was a few dings in it and you know, it wasn't in dead mint condition or anything like that. I've had it for a little while and he had some Paul Reed Smith boxes that had just come in that were unopened. Uh, he's a Paul Reed Smith dealer and he gets things in as they come off uh, the production line, you know, for, for, to fulfill his orders. And one of the labels said Tremonti and I thought, oh man, I have always wanted a Tremonti. I mean, really, that's why I originally got the white 594. I wanted a Tremonti. So we crack it open and this guy, is in there. This is a brand new guitar. It still, even right now, smells like brand new guitar. And I was instantly in love. You guys know how I love a tobacco burst. I love, also I really love the floating PRS bridge. It's the only floating bridge that I like on any guitar of any brand. This full floating bridge is brilliance. And I picked it up and I had to take it home. And then I did. And here's what it sounds like in a full mix. So having spent some time with this Tremonti, it's pretty interesting coming from the land of the Gibson Les Paul. This is very much a very modern Les Paul. It's a modern take on a Les Paul design, an updated version of that old classic design. Also, I hear similarities between this and my Les Paul custom. Like, you know, the Tremonti bridge pickup, correct me if I'm wrong, it sounds a lot like a Gibson 598T or a 500T, something in that vein. And this could be just my specific guitar, but this guitar doesn't sound totally different than my Gibson Les Paul Custom, which is a great thing. This is much more, I would liken this to a vintage muscle car that's been outfitted with a modern engine and electronics and modern brakes and you know, four piston disc brakes and you know, Brembo's and a modern exhaust system, but it still has that old aesthetic. But this is a very, very 
modern feeling instrument. Now, in comparison, a Gibson Les Paul is a classic, classic instrument that also feels like an old muscle car that is totally original. It still has drum brakes. It still has a carburetor, if this makes sense. You car guys would know exactly what I'm talking about. And that's okay. Like, there is a time and a place for that. But if you want a fast rock machine in a single cut package, you know, it's pretty tough to beat the PRS Tremonti. Like I said at the top of this video, I've had this for a couple of weeks now, and I was really looking for another Paul Reed Smith, if I ever got one, to compete with my flat black Custom 22, which in my opinion is one of the finest instruments I have ever owned, and this hangs with that instrument. You know, again, the floating bridge on these PRSs, the Mark III bridge, is unbelievably stable. This guitar, I think I've tuned this like twice since I've got it, real talk. Um, I've had it set up for drop C sharp with Ernie Ball Beefy Slinkies 11 to 54, and this is just a rock machine, and I love it so damn much. It's fast, it just, it, it also stays out of your way. I really, really love how this guitar plays and feels and sounds. There's a little bit of crunchiness in the top end of this guitar, which I actually really, really like, and the neck pickup isn't too muddy. It's warm, it's full, it's snappy, but there's still definition in the notes. Yeah, well done, Paul Reed Smith team on this amazing guitar. Um, yeah, I've never owned, I don't think, I don't think my Custom 22 was brand new when I got it. It might have been. I don't know, I don't know if it's been that long. Did I get it in 2018? Anyway, this 2021 Tremonti is an unbelievable instrument and I am uh, so blessed to be able to have this kind of instrument in my possession. And yeah, that's my, uh, that's my Paul Reed Smith Tremonti guitar, which you guys will be seeing a lot, I'm sure, in future videos to come. All applicable links down below in the description. You've been wonderful, I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. If you liked the video you just watched, please consider subscribing. And if you want to further support me and what I do, consider using some of the affiliate links down below in the description of this video. Go on over to Sweetwater, buy yourself something, and help me out at the same time. It's a win-win for both of us.